Hi guys, today we're going to play a shape game, okay? I've sent your mommy and daddy this little um, piece of paper. If you cannot print it out, you can either look at it on the screen or you can create one yourself or mommy and daddy can do it for you, okay? You're going to need that and you're going to need a piece of paper like that and you're going to need a dice and a pencil. Let's begin, okay? Here we have lots of different types of shapes. A rectangle, a triangle, a circle, a heart, a square, and an oval, okay? And here we've got different numbers that will appear on our dice. Number one, number one, two, number one, two, three, number one, two, three, four, number one, two, three, four, five, and number one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, let's draw the dice, okay? My number is number three, excellent. Number three is a circle. So I'm going to draw a circle first to practice and I'm going to draw it on my paper as well, okay? Now, play again. That's number five. Where's our number five? Here, it's a square. It's a square, draw a square. Excellent job. And again, number three again, which is our circle. Practice the circle first and then draw a circle, okay? And number three again. Number three is our circle. And draw a circle. Number one. Number one is a rectangle. Remember to hold the pencil properly, okay? Like this. A rectangle. Bravo. Continue playing, okay? Right, I've played a lot. And as you can see, I've got many different shapes on my piece of paper. If you want to continue this activity and do it, and do the optional one, okay? Get another piece of paper. And what I want you to do is, I want you to count how many circles have you got, okay? So in my case, I'm going to put a circle here, okay? Draw a circle, and then count your circles. In my case, there is one, two, three. So you've got three circles, just like this, okay? Now, let's count how many hearts have I got. You have to draw a heart, and then you have to tell us how many hearts have you got. So in my case, there will be one, two, number two, number two, and so on and so on. Now, you can make this even more difficult and you can ask yourself how many squares plus triangles have you got squares plus triangles you need to count all the squares in my case there is only one so that's one and triangles one two three so you've got one square and three triangles. How much is that all together? One, two, three, four. So the correct number is four. And you're going to write this down here. Squares plus triangles equals four. Continue your findings, guys, and send me all the evidence. Good luck!